there are times in your life when you're looking to do something a little different, maybe challenge yourself a bit. And uh, my time hit at around 40 years old. My first thought was, wow, run 100 miles, that, that's nearly impossible. But I knew there's other people that could do it, and I thought that this might be something that I could take on. The Leadville Trail 100 mile run is a race that was started in 1983. And uh, Leadville is about 70 miles west and 20 miles south of Denver, Colorado. Today we're going to do a 24 hour run. And this is what I see is probably the, the biggest thing I can do to help prepare. We're stationed at the Bettendorf High School football track. We're going to do some stair work. Uh, it doesn't really simulate the mountains exactly, but it's about the best we can do for now. And think that that's going to be awesome preparation for our run out in uh, Leadville in August. In addition to being a very rigorous physical experience, it's a tremendous uh, spiritual, emotional experience because you have lots of time on the trail, nature, God's beauty, and, you know, appreciate all that. But, you know, just think about a lot of the, the good things going on in your life. And, you know, those are things that can help motivate you. I never really thought of myself as a runner. So there had to be something a little bit extra than, than just completing a race for this one. It's also an opportunity to, to kind of go deep inside yourself, uh, reflect a little bit on life, kind of why you're here, what you're doing. A great time to reflect on the people in your life and uh, think about how much they mean to you uh, because you have time to think just about anything and everything. This training does take a major time commitment, getting up a lot of early mornings and being gone on long runs. This just opened my mind up to realize that many things are possible. I think it's just a matter of attitude and commitment and perseverance. And that's a very liberating and satisfying feeling.